Hi everyone and welcome back to another makeup video and today is going to be a bit different because we're going to be discussing about one of my favorite brands and it's Charlotte Tilbury and I'm sure that a lot of you love Charlotte Tilbury products and today I'll be ranking and swatching and discussing my nine Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadow palettes. So let's go ahead and get started. So the palette that comes in number nine is going to be the luxury palette of Pops in Pillow Talk. So here are close-up swatches of this palette. And the reason why this palette comes in number nine is because the pans are quite hard to get the pigment from. The sparkles are not as sparkly as I would like them to be. Like I like the sparkles to be quite soft and easy to apply and not as sheer as this one in this specific palette. The colors are beautiful but they're really hard to get a lot of pigment from but if you like very soft and you don't mind very sheer shimmer on your eyes then that's absolutely fine. My favorite color from the whole palette is this top one, the brown shade in the palette. It's really gorgeous. It has that reddish undertone, but it looks amazing on the eyes. Having one color from the other three that I really like doesn't make it enough for me to love the whole palette. So number eight goes to Green Lights Eyeshadow Palette. So these are the close-up swatches of this palette. And just before I did this video, I did check and this palette is discontinued. But this is a palette that came out last year. I didn't really reach out for it very often. I find that when I use all four colors together, it gives me a very dark eyeshadow look. So what I tend to do is I would do my makeup with another palette and then I would just combine one or two of these shadows into my eyes and then it would look really gorgeous. But the thing is with this formula, it glides on really well. You see all of the swatches are very pigmented. They were only one swipe and they do look really nice and they're very creamy. But an overall palette, if you like green shadows, then you might really like this palette. It's not one of my favorite palettes. That's why it's in number eight. But I sometimes when I want to create more of a green eyeshadow makeup look, I would use one of these colors with my other shades and then it would just complement it and it would look really gorgeous. So the palette that comes in number seven is going to be a little bit shocking to some of you. And this is going to be the Golden Goddess. So this is how the Golden Goddess palette looks like. I mean, it's a really beautiful palette. I just find that I don't use it very often. Um, I do come to it when I want, for example, that pale shade because it has more of a beigey yellow undertone it's really underestimated you know if you want to use it in the inner corner or underneath the brow bone when you want a highlighter but you don't want it to be super strong but my personal favorite favorite colors in this palette is this brown tone this is just so beautiful it has almost like a satin finish it has a tiny bit of a red undertone so it's not a flat brown it's just really really gorgeous and the pop shade in the palette which is almost like a grayish brown like it's really pretty and it's a very unique color especially for a sparkle shade and then comes the gray shade which I don't use very often but I always have this palette in my kit in case I need it or that I want to create more of that um, kind of grayish brown eye makeup look. Palette number six goes to the Copper Charge and this is another really beautiful palette from Charlotte Tilbury. The colors are very warm golden shades. It is really, really pretty. I love this one, especially in the summer when I'm a bit more tanned or on more warmer skin toned women. It looks absolutely beautiful. I love, love this specific color. It's so creamy, like the pigment is so intense and in this shade too and the mattes in this palette also works absolutely amazing like it blends out really easily the only shade that lacks a little bit is the one on top which is more of the sparkly shade it is softer but it's still very very gorgeous so if you like warm toned shades 
this palette is going to be really beautiful and the pigment is absolutely amazing in this one. Now for palette number five and this is one of my most recent eyeshadow palettes from Charlotte Tilbury and this is the Dazzling Diamond Luxury Palette of Pops. So here are the colors of this palette and unlike the Pillow Talk palette, although it's the same palette of Pops formula, these just needed only one swipe and you got the pigment. So the quality on this one was so much better and I absolutely love all of the colors. Like I love a really nice golden sparkle. The white also swatched really, really beautifully and intensely. And the two gold shades, although they looked quite similar in the palette, on my hands and on the eyes, they look very, very different. And of course, the star of the show of this palette is this gorgeous blue shade. Like I really, really like this color. I don't have anything similar to it. I did try it, which I never usually wear blue eyeshadows. But this specific one is like very deep and it has the sparkle and it looked amazing. It would also look amazing, you know, by itself on top of a cream eyeshadow. Like it's so beautiful and such a versatile shade. And I think it's going to look really nice on lots of skin colors and lots of eye colors. So a very versatile palette and I'm so looking forward to using it on so many people because it is so, so gorgeous and the quality is there. And for palette number four, it will be this gorgeous luxury palette in mesmerizing maroon. And you can see it's very, very unique in the colors it has. Here are the swatches of the shades. They're just so, so gorgeous. And these are also one swipe and you get this pigment. This specific eyeshadow was one of the color coded eyeshadow palettes. So this specific one was for green eyes. And of course, because it's my eye color. I really love this palette, especially when I want to create that really beautiful and spring colorful makeup look. This is amazing and you see the colors are very unique. They're very pigmented and I really, really love the matte shade. It's that really beautiful purple, but not too dark. Uh, it works really well and combined all the shades together. They look gorgeous on the eyes. The only thing is the sparkle shadow is not as pigmented, but it's still very, very pigmented that you can wear it by itself or you can add it on top of the eyeshadows like the rest of the colors and it complements it so, so well. Such a beautiful palette, absolutely amazing. If you like these rosy, more purpley shades, this palette has all of the things to really create that stunning spring makeup look. Palette number three goes to the most iconic palette from Charlotte Tilbury and I'm sure you know what I mean. And this is the Pillow Talk eyeshadow palette and of course this is one of the most gorgeous eyeshadow palette that Charlotte Tilbury has. Here are close-up swatches of the shades and they're just fantastic like this palette could not be duped. I've tried many times to dupe especially these two shades because they're so unique. You know, they have the right amount of color and pigmentation if you want that really sheer, beautiful, you know, very fresh makeup look on your eyes. It's amazing. And I also use this palette all the time on brides. It works absolutely amazing. I love the fact that this pale shade is a tiny bit more pinky and this sparkle is just so beautiful. It's something between like a pink and a peach and it complements so many eye colors so well. So if you're looking for that really soft lit from within eye, this is the palette for you. So for the last two palettes, it was very difficult to choose which one was my absolute favorite because they're both very, very close to my heart because I love both. They're both absolutely amazing. But for palette number two, it's going to go to the Fire Rose palette. And this is one of her latest palettes. It's limited edition. And for the first time in my life, I bought a backup of an eyeshadow palette because the minute I used it from the first moment I applied it, I was like, wow, this is amazing. I really don't wanna run out of this palette. So that's how much I love this palette. And if you see now from my swatches, it just swatches so, so beautifully. 
Again, this is one swipe. They're very, very creamy, very buttery. With this first shade, although it looks much paler in the pan, when I put it on my eyes, it just has that really beautiful rose gold without being too warm. And then this bronzy shade is just something else. Like I usually don't like brown eyeshadows because they tend to be very flat, but this one is very different. It's very beautiful on the eyes and it just brightens the whole thing. And the burgundy shade is just so pigmented. It looks amazing, you know, in the outer corner of the eyes. I absolutely love it. And then you have the pop shade, which is very different formula than any of the pop shades that Charlotte Tilbury has. It's so pigmented, so sparkly, but without being that chunky glitter, it just looks so smooth on the eyes and it's it's just amazing so i love love this palette so although this is a very new palette to charlotte tilbury it has become one of my top eyeshadow palettes ever and i don't want to run out so i hope that charlotte tilbury keeps this eyeshadow palette as a permanent because everybody's going crazy about it for the last palette and the number one palette from Charlotte Tilbury, in my opinion, that I absolutely love. And I think if you haven't got this palette, it's an absolute must. And this is the Dolce Vita palette, uh, which is now called the Bella Sofia. And this palette is just something else. I've never ever tried any eyeshadow palette that I loved as much as this one. The colors are so, so beautiful. You can create a gorgeous look using all four colors and they're just amazing like you get the white color which is not too pale not too sparkly it's almost that perfect kind of sheen and this second burgundy color is just absolutely amazing i have some on my crease and i could not find any other eyeshadow that looks like this shade because it just makes any eye makeup elevate so much more and make it look amazing and then this uh, brown tone which is quite a basic color but this specific one has a little bit of shimmer and it looks so beautiful on the eyes and lastly is the sparkle and if you can see i have some on my eyelid and again, this specific color, it's that golden coppery shade that just, it's just amazing. Like I've never ever come across a shade like this and it just makes the eyes, you know, just pop but in a very sultry way, in a very simple way. And I absolutely love it. This palette is always going to be in my makeup kit. I hope that you liked today's video and that it was useful for you. If you want to buy a Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadow and you are not sure which one to get, and I would love to know which one is your favorite eyeshadow palette from Charlotte Tilbury or even from any other brand, I always love getting recommendations from other people and if you like this video and you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't yet subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe and become part of my channel. Thank you so much again for watching and I'll see you next time.